today's video i'm gonna be doing a makeup tutorial well showing my makeup tutorial i've been seeing a lot of people do this so this is my first video because i want to start youtube so yeah um let's get started so what you want to do first is moisturize or like do your skincare i've already done mine now i'm gonna moisturize because if not you're gonna look cakey so yeah that's what i'm gonna do I already kind of did, but I'm just going to add more. <laughs> My skin is not the clearest because I do have some acne on my forehead and cheeks. And as you can see right here, yeah. Okay, so after you've moisturized, you're going to put on your sunscreen. I use two fingers of it and then just rub it in. This sunscreen makes me like glowy, but it has like a cat white cast, but it's fine. <laughs> Bro, it looks so white. Honestly, I kind of look oily or glowy, but I don't know. Okay, so now that I've done that, next you want to do is prime your face. I used um, the Professional Minimalizing Balm. But I just take a little bit of it right here, just like that, and then rub it in between my fingers. The places I put it is like right here. Okay, so now what you want to do, well, what I do is I take my foundation, I use the NARS Sheer Glow Foundation shade medium two you can't really see but yeah i use a brush to apply my foundation first so i'm gonna do like this oh my gosh i forgot one step i forgot to use this green concealer I used this to conceal my red acne, but I forgot to, so. So once I kind of like put it everywhere, I'm gonna use a beauty blender. I already wet it. I just put water, but I'm just gonna blend it. Okay, so once you blend it good enough, you can still see some acne, a lot actually, but. Okay, just like that. Next, I'm going to do my eyebrows. Um, I don't know where my eyebrow pen went. Oh my gosh. I don't know where my eyebrow pen went or like where I put it. I'm just going to use this one. And this is the Wet n Wild Ultimate Brow Retractable Brow Pencil. Looks like this. I'm going to brush my eyebrows up so that they're brushed through. My eyebrows are not even. They're not even, so I try my best to make them even, but they never do. So I'm gonna look in my mirror and then do my eyebrows. Yeah. And then I'm gonna like pull it this way to make it kind of straight. I'm gonna kind of like drag it down. And then you're gonna brush through them like that it looks kind of good so so now I'm gonna do the other one off camera okay so now that I've done both eyebrows as you can see this one is not perfect it's gonna fill in more than yeah they look really messy but okay and then I kind of have to shape it back again because I raised it. Okay, so now that they look like that, I'm going to get my foundation brush that I used um, literally earlier for my foundation. And then I'm going to take my foundation to, like, conceal them. They're still different. Okay, I'm gonna fix it. Be right back. 
Okay, so I've done my eyebrows. They do not look the same. But it's fine. I don't care, that's plain. I'm done. I'm gonna blend it. Okay, now I'm gonna do, put on my contour. Not contour, bronzer. I don't know what kind of shade this would be for, but I just like put it right here. Only take a little bit because from the wand, it's a lot. And so then I take it from the side right here. And I'll put it on my forehead to make my forehead smaller because it's the biggest flap. Next, I'm gonna use my concealer. I have two. I just bought this one today, but I don't know if it's gonna match. I'm scared to mess up my makeup. I usually use the elf one, but I kind of I'm kind of running out. So I'm gonna use this. I'm scared. It looks really light. I put it on my nose. This is my first time trying this concealer, so we're gonna see if it's good or not. And then I'm gonna take this e.l.f. camel one that's, I think, lighter. Put it right here. Bro, it's kinda already the same shade. So I'm gonna blend my con contour bronzer first. Guys, I'm gonna freaking tie my hair back in a closet because I cannot do this. We are going to, I'm going to add a little bit more concealer because I like mine right to be pretty bright. I'm going to add this light ivory one to kind of highlight my face. I'm going to do my blush. I'm going to use a brush to put this on and then tap it here so I don't get too much, but... More brush. Now I'm gonna powder. I'm gonna like set my eyes. <gasps> I've got a freaking contour on my nose. Okay, as you can see. I'm gonna do like a little bit since it goes a long way. Like that. Okay. Now, once I look funny, I'm gonna blend it. Now that my nose looks like this, I'm gonna bring back some life into it with the same concealer I used. Okay, I'm gonna do the side of my nose too. So I'm trying to look snatched. Okay, now I'm gonna freaking set. So I'm gonna use this puff. So I'm gonna like. Oh, I used the Fit Me powder in the shade 10. Kind of looks like a ghost. It's in my eyeball. Okay, and then I'm gonna put just a little bit more. I'm gonna set under my cheekbones to really outline whatever this is. My contour powder is really uneven from each other okay i'm gonna let that sit i'll be contouring now so i'm gonna use this brush right here and i'm gonna just do it like this on my like nose bridge if you can feel it yeah you can already kind of see my nose is contoured so i'm gonna go under my nose to kind of create a button nose and then push it up Pinch it to make a, a line across. Okay, so now I'm gonna take a little bit on the bigger side and then use it as like an eyeshadow to blend it better. Oh my gosh. Kind of like do this outwards to create lifted look. I want to take big side and kind of blend it. So once I look like this, it's really bad. We're gonna powder the sides to make it better. I'm gonna move you guys at a better angle. So now we're gonna grab some powder. Like 
do an outline of this. Okay, so now that it looks like this, you can see the outline. We're gonna powder in the middle, so. Fit. So now I'm gonna rub off the powder under my eye. I'm gonna do my eyeliner. I'm running out of eyeliner. I need to go find more. So now I'm gonna make do my eyeliner off camera because it's gonna be really hard. As you can see, one side of my eyeliner is bigger than the other. I'm just gonna stop. I'm gonna move on because you see, I wiped off my powder and my concealer. We're done. Okay, next waterline on my eye my top line now you're not really gonna be able to see the eyeliner anyways because i'm gonna be putting on my eyelashes so so i'm gonna wipe away my powder you see this this is gonna be so mad this is gonna the lashes i'm gonna be using so i'm gonna let these dry i don't really do this but i'm gonna add lash glue to my eyeliner or like my eye to make them stick better so while everything's drying i'm gonna do my nose highlights i use the nyx jumbo pencil in the shade milk and i'm gonna like so i'm still gonna blend it so i'm gonna put some of my eyebrows above my fingers because it's easier oh and also put it on my inner corner it's not perfect but i'm gonna fix it Where's my tweezer um i use a tweezer to put on my lashes because i find that easiest for me my eyeball open while doing it because I feel like if I close it, it's gonna look weird. So this is what my lashes look like. They won't be even. Okay, so I got my lashes. I'm gonna do the highlighter. I'm gonna like push it to blend it so it's not really white. It doesn't have to be perfect because we're gonna put highlighter on it. So I use this palette my mom gave it to me. And then I use these two shades right now. Put it in the inner corner. I'm gonna take the gold for that my nose highlight. Look at that. This is what it looks like. I think we're done. I gotta do my lips. I use the shade Nutmeg by NYX for brown and then I'm just that. I use this. Laura Mercier, my lipstick. So what I do is I take this and then I overline. And then do my bottom lip. I did like the inside right here on my lip. To get that pouty look. I'm gonna take this right here and then dab in the middle. My lips aren't even. Okay. I use this lip maximizer lip gloss. Okay, we're done.
Okay, this is the finished look. Oh, this is a new model. Okay, guys, thank you for watching my makeup tutorial. Thank you for even watching in the first place. I think. But make sure to subscribe and like and comment down below if this was helpful or not. Because I just did my makeup to stay in my room and take pictures. But bye!